All right, everybody, welcome back for another deep dive. Today we're uh, do it. we're doing something a little different this time. We're only looking at one piece of source material. Oh wow! So this is a a snippet from a YouTube video transcript. Okay. And the title of the video is "Best Feature Versus by Mingo Part 4. Ooh, Part Four. That's you, intriguing. Thinking, I know, right? It's like, what is this best feature versus by Mingo? Yeah. What if we stumbled onto here? Yeah, and like you said, Part Four. So this is yeah. This is like a whole <laughs> world that we don't even know. You know, right? Of Mingo content. Right. So the transcript snippet that we have starts with "best feature versus by Mingo Part Four. Okay. And then it just has these three words: foreign, pull up, and mingle up. Hmm. That's it. Okay. So, I mean, the first thing that pops to mind when I see feature verses, I immediately go to music. Okay. Um, and specifically, I would say probably rap or, you know, R&B or huh. hip hop, you know, something like that. Yeah. Where you have somebody featured on a song and they do a verse. Huh. So that's what feature verse yeah. sounds to me. Okay. So we're already in the music world, it sounds like. I think so, yeah. Yeah. There's a good chance. Okay. Interesting. And what about those three words? Foreign? Pull up. Mingle up. Well, you know, uh, like you said, it's kind of cryptic. Yeah. Um, but I think there's a lot we can unpack there. You know, foreign, maybe that's talking about like, you know, international sounds mm -hmm. or influences. Yeah. You know, maybe this Mingo is somebody who's really incorporating like world music. Yeah. Into what they do. Okay. Pill up. That to me sounds like a call to action. Oh, you know, okay. Like, come check this out. You know, get involved. Yeah. Mingle up. That makes me think of community. Yeah. You know, like everybody getting together, <laughs> yeah. like all mingling up and enjoying the music. So. Yeah. So or, is it, <laughs> I was going to say, is it too much to read into these three words to say, like, we're starting to get a picture of what this Mingo character is about? No, I don't think so at all. I mean, if these yes. are, you know, representative of his music, if these are words that he's using in his music, yeah. you know, they, they could be very telling, I think. So maybe someone who's bringing people together right. through music, using sounds from all over the world and, you know, pull up. So, you know, come... Come join the party. Yeah. Come check this out. Exactly. Okay. So now I got to know, what does it take to have the best feature verses? That's a great question. All right. I mean, to be the best, you have to have a mastery of your craft, right? Yeah. So I would imagine, you know, we're talking about like lyrical complexity, flow delivery, you know, all of that. Yeah. But I think with feature verses, it's even more than that. Yeah. Because you're coming in on somebody else's track. Oh, that's a good point. So you have to be able to yeah. adapt yeah. to their style and still stand out. Yeah, be able to like... Right. Yeah, bring your own thing, but also fit into this, you know, puzzle piece that they're giving you. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Man, I hadn't even considered that. So it's almost like a whole other level of musical... I think so, yeah. yeah. Artistry. Absolutely. Right. I mean, it, if you're consistently being asked to do feature verses and people are saying these are the best feature verses... Right. That's... That says something. That says a lot. Wow. So, I mean, just from this one little snippet of a video transcript title and these three words, yeah. we're already getting the sense of, like, who this Mingo is and, like, yeah. the kind of music they're making. And like I said, the fact that this is part four. I know. That really intrigues me. I want to go back and I want to find parts one, two, and three now. Yeah, me too. And, like, just hear these best feature verses. Exactly. You know, makes them so good. Yeah. What is it about them? Well, I think that about wraps it up for this deep dive. Okay. I got to say, though, this one has been a real mind bender. I know. You know, we started with just this, you know, scrap of a YouTube video transcript title. Right. And we ended up just imagining this whole musical world and this artist. And Yeah. Who is this Mingo? I know, right? What kind of music are they making? What are their feature verses like? So many questions. A lot of questions. Well, for everyone listening out there... Thank you so much for joining us on another deep dive. Yeah, thanks for listening. And until next time, keep on diving. Keep diving. Into whatever interests you. That's right. Bye. See ya.